guys, welcome back. Today I've got a tiny one wide one chest shot. So if I just come over here and put some emeralds in, it will give me a diamond back. And this works for any amount. So if I just chuck them in, you'll just see them filtering out now. This is set to, as you can see, emeralds and diamonds. Put anything else in and it won't work. And obviously, as you can see, this is tiny as it's only one wide. See, look at that, it works perfectly. And another great thing about this is that in some designs you can actually get to the hoppers below the below the chest effectively. So you could just steal items or make it break. Whereas this one there's no access to any of them as long as you put a block here. So as soon as you go around to the side you can see this thing is absolutely tiny. So you put your item in here, it will go into here. And because the first first space is always filtered out first, one goes in here opens up for enough time to let one more out that one goes in there and there you can see there's the 63 and the 64th emerald and also during this time this just makes it um, open up so it opens up this hopper for the same amount of time allowing 64 other items to filter through so as I said I've set this one to diamonds and it only accepts emeralds which is the first one and that's because these items I've just renamed so you'd rename it something that no one's gonna guess and this would mean that they can't just chuck any item in it would have to be your set item to build it you're going to need the items you can see in my inventory below with the one on the far right being the building blocks and this one being the place where you're going to put the items in you can use a chest but as I said earlier it's more open to um, thieving so you're going to start by putting this down putting a hopper going into the back of it so like that by shift clicking then you're going to want to put one below it but make sure it's facing this way otherwise the um, otherwise it won't work so like that and then that's the same for the one below it so put another block down and a hopper there and this one's going to go into a chest now over here over here you're going to put in a block by shift clicking again get your comparator facing out of it one block along and then one block down so like this and then you're also going to put one there and on the other side of this so like a little cross and then a piece of redstone here, here, and then get your comparator, send out this way, redstone torch, and then over here you're going to put a block with a redstone torch on top of it, and then over here, three pieces of redstone up here. Now on top of this hopper you can put a chest and then more hoppers depending on how much stock you want to have, but yeah this is where you're going to put your stock. And that is it guys, that's all you need, and then I'll just show you what to put in your hoppers now. Now you're going to put your stock in up here, and make sure at least one of these goes into this, this one down here, otherwise it won't work and you'll get one less. Now in this hopper you're going to want to put the item you're wanting to receive, and then 21 of any other item, but just make sure that it's pro um, preferably renamed or something unusual that people won't just guess. And then these two you can just leave as they are and these ones will be filled up with the items that they chuck in which will be in this case emeralds. So that's all you need and this is just a fantastic design for a, a one stop shop. I hope you found this tutorial useful guys and I hope to see you next time.